I'm Mackenzie Owiti from Kenya. I'm a mechanical technician. Uh, my problem started in way back when I was young, but uh, it wasn't managed well. So at around age of around uh, 19 is when it came up to be a problem. During my college level, I started having the pain. The first x-ray was done, it was uh, realized I had osteoarthritis. That was the time that we realized I had a hard task to come up with. Last year, December, now I fell down, getting a fracture on the same joint. So that was when, from December, last, from December 2015, I've never been to work. Then uh, NHIF is the one which introduced us to ANK Global Health, which led us to getting into Manipal Hospital, where we got a superb introduction into the hospital. Registration as a patient, getting guided into the system, guiding you to where you're supposed to be at any given moment. For any reference to the doctor, to the nurses, to whichever unit you wish, at least we got assistance from the international office. I believe I got the best doctor. Dr. Sunil really is a hands-on doctor. Giving you the best of care, giving you the care that you need, giving you the information that you need hands-on. So with the doctor's uh, doings, giving, us, giving me another life, a pain-free life from here and forth, it's better than living a life in pain throughout. My joints were grinding every day of my life from ever since my childhood days. Right now, I have some, I have relief. After the operation, I was given a ceramic joint, which is better than any other joint. It can last for over 25 years, if, it, if I take care of it well. From the second day of my surgery, I got off the bed with the walker, started crawling my legs at least, but now I do move. There's nothing other than saying thank you, and it is in God's hands that I, I believe Dr. Sunil gave me a, a good joint to, a, and a pain-free future. Um, I first saw McKinsey. He started having a left hip uh, pain from the past uh, 10 or odd years, uh, but became serious only about uh, five years back. The past six months after an accident, he found it progressively difficult to even ambulate a few steps without having much pain. Uh, that's when he consulted to ca decided to come down to our hospital. Uh, I did a few x-rays uh, which indeed show that uh, he had got what is what we call as a fused hip in the sense the whole head as well as the neck had actually migrated into the socket and uh, fused in that position. So examination wise he did not have any movement or what we call least a jog of movements at the hip. He also had uh, a rotational deformity of the hip as, as well as shortening of about uh, an inch or slightly more than that. Uh, we decided to go ahead uh, with the uh, uh, hip replacement uh, surgery on the left side after the necessary investigations and evaluation were done, we took him up for surgery. There are quite a few challenges from a surgical point of view. The first was the exposure, because in this case it was a fused hip, uh, which was proximally migrated all the way up and uh, it was bone on bone. So we first had to create what we called a new socket from nowhere. And the second challenge well, when we put all the implants was actually to get uh, the uh, head back into the socket because it had migrated all the way up. So we had to do a lot of release in that way. Uh, Post-surgery it showed that immediately uh, day after surgery he started to uh, weight bear with the help of a walker. At present at about two weeks uh, time down the line he is much comfortable uh, with his ambulation and he's absolutely pain free. I believe this hospital has done me good. With the doctors what I've received during my inpatient period I got the best of treatments by the nurses. I got the best hands-on by the doctor who operated me. I got the best on hands-on by the facilities they gave for me and my caretaker. I believe Manipal Hospital is a referral point for orthopedic issues to do for any patients within Kenya. I give my best of experience coming to this place having known and having experienced it now two weeks after my surgery after two weeks after coming from kenya now i am in the best of positions to tell that i can now walk without much of pain 
but with assistance, I know with the physios, I, within six weeks, I'll be having to walk without any assistance and moving back to my job, doing everything that I wish to do.